Okay, so I'm going to get the jewel. The problem being... Okay, now here's... I got up this before. <laughs> Tropic Communist skill issue. <laughs> ah! That is the entirety of this game. It is nothing but rage and mistakes. Oh! Oh, oh, oh I did it! Yes! Oh, I made the game function normally! This is shit. No! No, 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 no! That leads there, so that literally mean leads nowhere. This, this, this entire passage leads to nothing. And now it's a red jewel and the green jewel. What the fuck is going on? Um, okay, I guess we have to go down here. This makes me nervous because I don't want to die because I'm worried that the game will soft lock again if I die. Um, but we have to go down here. It's our only option and we have to go down to this unknown passage. Please don't run out of air. Please don't run out of air. Buddy, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Do buddy, no. No. Okay, I'm, go I'm going back up to get some air. I'm too- I'm for chat. I am so fucking afraid right now. Uh, by the way, John, do you ever plan to stream Melissa again? Yeah, absolutely. Th there's loads of shit I want to stream. Um, so I don't know when I'm going to play Alyssa next, but I will play it again on stream. Okay, this is okay. This is okay. Go back and get your shit and save. I don't want to go back through the door because I'm scared. I'm, s I'm scared it will lock me again. There has to be a save point soon. Save point. Okay. We're okay. We're okay. We can do this. A city, an underground city cut out of giant stalactites. Oh, I don't like the look of this. It looks deserted, but the system of pulleys and ganaches seem to be well maintained, and gantries seem to be well maintained. The bridges to the central stalactite are closed. If I can reach this rope, surely I'll be able to get there. As long as this isn't a first person section, I don't mind. Interesting. There's a magical ring at your feet. Okay, these blue people keep appearing. That's actually quite well done. Like the way they're peeking out at you and stuff. Another magical ring. The magical ring are basic is basically like an extra life in this game. Oh god, you can fall off. Awesome. That's really good news. Okay, why come down here? Yeah, why why bring us down here if there's nothing? Can we go down again? Can we go down another level? We can, okay. like water oh that is that is too huge a body of water that makes me uncomfortable but what is that glowing thing over there
then we also have a tower down there that we need to check out. My brain is trying really hard to keep myself orientated, which it does not usually do. So desperate is my fear of this game. Do you have your resurrection stone, John? I don't believe I do. Why? Why? No, I don't have my resurrection stone. Don't tell me... The start is to your left. Oh, why? No, why? Why, why, why? Why, why, why? You might need it. Okay. No, everything's fine. Everything's fine. I don't need it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, good. There was another way behind the green fire. Oh, shh. Does that mean I have to travel back over? And now we're just back here, right? We've just done a big circle. Uh, does old equal better? Better equals better. It doesn't matter when it was made. It just matters if it's actually good. The problem with this game is not that it is old. So many amazing games came out by 1999, okay? Like, I will say in early retro gaming, like pre-Nintendo era, there's not a lot of great games because the what the hardware people were working with was so limited. Past, like, the Nintendo era, there are so many amazing games this is not one of them. Okay, is this where you guys were talking about? Because there ain't nothing here either. Okay, fuck it. We're going to be here all night. I'm, I'm looking up the guide. Cross the catwalk and then the next bridge. Go to the left. Oh, this is so fucking complicated. I don't remember seeing any hidden green buttons. I best... I should probably start from the beginning of this section and just follow this exactly. Um, oh yeah, I, I have already met Cyber Bowie. Um, David Bowie voices a character in this game, which just is so shocking when you think about it. I think you pressed one green button to lower the two bridges. Did I not crank a shaft? People keep saying don't tell him and it's making me so worried. Um... Oh! <sighs> I don't have my life potions. I am so sure that some of you saying don't tell him is you don't know what's happening. I don't think he knows. So that's the sh that's the cra that, that's the crank I sh that's the sh the thing I cranked. Oh god. Oh, magical ring. Five magic rings, hell yeah. Oh. I think I'm solving this by accident. Um. Okay, but now this one is fuck. Oh my god, I hate this fucking game. Just nowhere to go, just... Are you serious? What's the point of that? I was about to turn back and search this entire area! Okay, please, please... Oh my god, I there's barely enough space! There's nothing here? There's nothing here? Oh, there's a lift! Okay! Up, I guess. Did I, did I solve it? Is it solved? Uh 
Um, what the fuck is going on? Uh, I just want to have a little look around before I go into whatever that seems to be. Because I would like to save if possible. Okay, there's a save point over there, so I'm guessing I have to go into this hut before I can save. Okay. Hello, friends. The spirits of the dead predicted your coming. So, you are the nomad soul announced by the prophecy. Looking at you, it's hard to believe that you are going to change the fate of our universe. You are in the Azkiel city of Mary, in the temple Azkiel have raised to my glory. The Azkiel's? I don't want to know. Tell me about the nomad soul prophecy. Prophecy engraved on the walls of Hamishtag predicts that one day a nomad soul will come to destroy the son of evil. If the nomad soul fails, the demon will become the master of our universe. A chance to destroy him won't come again for 999,000. And who are you? I am Soyinka, the goddess queen, daughter of Matanbukus, the renegade sorcerer. I am the last great master of the ancient art, still living on. Uh, okay. I have nothing new to tell her. So, what, what do I do? Okay, awesome, great interaction. Is this just letting me back out into the main area to do nothing? Because it sure feels like it. Yeah, there's the crank. We're just back. Oh, we can save. is also nothing. Um Okay. I guess we got to go over there. So let's go over there. Maybe the bridge will come down like it did with the other one. Oh my god, this is so confusing. Okay, there it is. One more time, let me just check the guide, because this is this shit is just maddening. It's just maddening. Um anyways, I have to see the game off the south side and into the water. You can really have the energy where there. Swim to the land at the end and talk to the Askeel there. What does the land at the end mean? I'm guessing it's maybe this this blue part or th this part with the green flame we were at earlier So is the ancient art being a wizard the ancient art is 100% being a wizard. I can confirm that Okay, now there's a character here so talking to the wizard queen triggered this character why doesn't fucking matter What did it mean for the story nothing nothing matters? Mega honor for me to receive, Nomad Soul. What can for? Oh no, I'm so sorry, chat. Nomad Soul. I need, I I need a sham to get to Hamstigan. To help Nomad Soul, 
is the great honor for Fodo. Take Sha, present from Fodo to Nomad Soul. Real Jar Jar Binks energy Take from this guy. In rock not far away. That be way to Hammerstagen. Don't go there. Too dangerous. Okay, so now I think I have to go check the rock and then go back to him, according to the guide. I think that has to be what he's what the what the guide's talking about. Welcome to hell, John. I'm already so deep in hell. What possibly more could be waiting for me? I have nothing to say to him. John, um... But... But what do I... What do I do? This is the best part. But how? Talk to Photo again and walk into the green liquid nearby. Okay. What 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 green liquid? Is is this the green liquid? The stinky goo. This stuff? But it's on fire! Ah, uh, this mixture is vile. Is this it, chat? Is this what I'm Oh god fucking damn it. I'm sorry, I'm frustrated, okay? I'm sorry, chat. I love you, I'm sorry. Tell me, Frodo, what are the tins of stinking liquid all around the farm for? That be the Klebon to keep Grubos away from shams. Grubos like eat shams. The Klebon smell so stink, they stay away. That way, no problem. Most important, you stay away from the Klebon. Deadly poison. Kill you straight away. Um, not sure. And doesn't the smell of that stuff bother you? Fodo used to it. Shams also smell very bad. Okay. I have nothing to say. I can't get on the sham. He doesn't want me to get on. Nothing interesting. Drink the goo, John. Get in the goo. I can't get in the goo. There's no way to get in the goo. See, he's just like, see, there's nothing. I can't jump in it. Slurp it up, John. I can't get in the shot. Drink this goo. Chat, I can't drink the poison goo. Trust me, I want to. I want to so badly. The sham won't let me climb on. Think of this. Shams, very uh, untrusting. First know you, then let you mount. Catacomb Shams never see human like you. Fodo, sorry. But journey to Hamastagan, not possible. No mount. But I absolutely must have found Sham. Fodo cannot help. Sorry. Must be as keel in order to mount Sham. Say to him.
Okay, okay, fine, sure, sure, fine, God, okay. Nothing in particular. It's a sham! Ride the sham! Okay, I can only ride this one. I bet the controls for this are amazing. Oh my fucking God. Thank you, my loyal sham. Okay. Okay. We continue onward. What was that? Uh oh! It's a monster! Battle has begun! Fight! Discovered in this game that you can win every fight by just mashing jab. The potion no longer affects you. I- what the f- what potion? The legends are true, these tombs contain the remains of the masters of ancient art. This place seems dangerous, I'd better be careful. This is gonna be great. What is that? What was that? Ghosts? Oh my god. Please die. So are, are we're in hell, right? That's that's what's happening? I'd like to know if there's a way to kill Astaroth. Toward the end of the Cobalt Wars, when humans and demons were engaged in a merciless struggle, magicians came to consult the dead. Five minutes later. Combat. For seven days and seven nights, they fought. Then the two fighters fell back. All of bitterness and vexation because of his terrible failure. Oh my he gosh. He small temple island with Barkaya. Ever since then, he has awaited the coming of a new hero. To what would happen if the Nomad Soul failed to kill Astaroth? Astaroth would become master of the Chance to kill wouldn't come again for another 999,000 years. His temporal island is somewhere beyond the dome of Omicron. What must I do to kill us? to Mahahadil and ask Kushilen for Bakaya in order to destroy us. Goodbye, man made of copper. Letter appears to cover the Book of Nouts. To reach this island beyond time, incantation must chant ghost. Chant for a ghost. Three, beware if 
it's, if, if I want to find Kishan, I'll have to explore the tomb of Hastagan. Oh god, okay. Uh, I can kill the ghosts, right? What is happening? Oh my god. I'm guessing what I have to find is somewhere in this area. That looks like something. Ah! That looks promising. Oh, the fall damage in this game is so insane. Let's grab some health. What in the fuck just happens? Okay, that was not the right door. So is that what this is? Walking up to ghost doors and seeing if there's a ghost in them or not? Okay, I guess he didn't want to fight. Yeah, I think we just have to go up to ghost doors until a ghost doesn't come out and some fucking treasure or something emerges. I wonder will there be a ghost behind this door? Yes, there will! So, I remember there being doors at the huts. Maybe I can press them. Another ghost! Oh, god damn it. Hi, John, having fun and all the enemies reset. All the enemies reset on this piece of shit game. Please die, just die, please die. Please just die. Just, just die. Just. trying to stealth these guys. Is he dead? Like, what is happening? I think he's just dead. Okay, whatever. Oh, that looks like a good ghost. That looks like a friend ghost. We can, we can tell it's a friend ghost because it has giant titties and in David Cage's mind, that's what equals friend. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh my God. Uh, do I, do I need to find more titty ghosts? Jesus, that, that is some face. Yep, yeah, good. Demonetize now. Thanks, David.
I feel like there's no rhyme or reason for when they die. Like, it just takes forever every time. I feel like some of the enemies, like, they're not actually enemies. They just float there. Like, like they're not programmable enemies. They're just pieces of the scenery. Have we tried this door? I, I hate this game, chat. I hate this game so much. I hate it so much. I would re I would literally rather be doing anything else in the fucking world right now than playing this game. Oh my god, the fucking game freaked out there. Oh, I'm getting pelted. I'm getting pelted. Oh, I'm going down. I'm going down. This is the first one. Okay, okay. I, I think I'm developing. I'm developing a tactic to fight the ghost chat. A little duck and weave is all it takes. And I think there's a big health pack up there, so I'm gonna go get it. I want to go down slowly because I don't want to take damage. We cannot afford a lot of damage. See, that's not an enemy. That just It's just a fucking flying thing. Do you have any idea for your next recommendation for Wooly? Oh, oh, oh. Yes, I do, chat. I know exactly what I'm recommending him. So I think the first one. Okay, that's just that's just that's a fake ghost. These things kind of look like Donkey Kong. Okay, so I think this was one of them. Nice. Okay. Then I think the other one is meant to be similar. So here. Oh, shit. Oh, it's hard when they're this close, chat. Fucking hate this game so much. Okay, so Turn the run. Oh, so mm, I don't think it was here, but I'll check. It was here. Okay, awesome. Okay, that's three ghosts. Let me look up this final location and we can be free of this hell. Okay. Okay, we're nearly done. So I think it wants us to jump down onto this one of the roofs. I think it's here. I think this is it. Oh, there's a health kit down there. And I think, I think this is the last door. Yes! Okay, nice.
Three ghosts have now been freed. Awesome. Not... God, I am so low on health. Oh, please, please let me go back to my inventory. Because if anything happens, I'll die. If I step off a ledge that's too high, I'll die. Why doesn't my health just carry over? I had to find this ledge because it's safe. Oh god, it's so, just such a nightmare of a game to navigate. Please, David Cage, please just let me back up onto the ledge. I just, I just want this to end. Okay, the tunnel in there doesn't... It has to be in there, though, because that's the only fucking place. Oh, my God. Okay, let's just start following walls until we end back up to where we want to go. For those of you watching, I appreciate you being here. Why you would want to be, I have no idea. I just, if I had a choice in this, I would be anywhere else in the world besides having anything to do with this game. Thank you for the subscription, Big Coffee. It's a great name. Just, just, just step up on the ledge. Just step up on that tiny ledge. Please. Please. Thank you for the subscription to Comic Fiend. Your, your emotional support means more than I can ever, I can ever say. Oh look, it's my three giant goth wives. Okay, sure. Why not? What do we, what, what is that a fucking giant spade? Well, I don't even know. I don't, I don't, I don't just don't. I feel like I've missed the entrance to this thing. But torturously, torturously, they don't care. They just let you run around until you hit nothing. Or do I slide down this ramp? Chat, I'm scared. I don't want to die. I don't, I have so little health and I don't want to die. Oh, what is this shit? What do we have to do now? <sighs> you don't heal. I, I don't have any potions. I don't... They, I have been cut off from my inventory since near the start of this. It can't, well, it can't be platforming because those platforms are too far. Unless the, unless the gravity on this planet is really low. Yeah, like we ain't getting far with that jump. Okay, let's just let's just look it up. Let's just look it up. Um, when you're done, run back to the book and three. Use the save point. And oh, there's a save point near here. Okay, we've got to find that save point first of all. Save point chat must see the save point there it is there it is beautiful come here you come here buddy oh i know we're close i know we're so close yeah i know i know i know i know i have to check the guide again i will turn the camera back on in a sec okay doesn't look like there's too much left we can do this 
So basically, we just have to stand on the right block. It would be really weird for it to be one of these identical blocks. But... I guess at this point, anything's possible. Where are we going? What do, what do we do? <gasps> on one of the closer blocks, you can stand on it and you'll be taken on one of the closer blocks. So I guess that means closer from the ramp. He brought this on himself. People keep saying that. I didn't. I am the good guy of versus wolves, okay? I am the person who puts up with the evil of Wooly. I never did this to Wooly. Uh, it's kind of amazing how Fearing Hunger manages to be obtuse and tell and make the story and by difficulty, but rewards experience the game just feels difficult in the worst way possible. I don't think that the people who made this game think that it's difficult because they designed it so they're like you just stand on the right block but they don't get that not everyone knows which block to fucking stand on so you just walk around like an idiot i i am i am at a complete loss okay look up the block on youtube fuck it you're right okay the, the exact same thing is happening what the fuck? Which block is that? Okay, yeah, it's one of the L blocks. That has the view. Okay. It would be really weird for it to be one of these identical blocks. Alright! I did not press a fucking thing. I did not press anything. Let's try that again. Oh my fucking god, okay, come on, please, please, please. Come for the Breckel. The magicians in Feanor closed their souls in the blade a thousand, thousand years ago. This is where its magical this is power, where power its to destroy Astaroth came to from. The souls Astaroth. of the magicians will not be freed until Astaroth is slain with the back yell. Tell me about your battle with Astaroth. After seven After days seven and seven days, nights of relentless combat, Astaroth and I both fell to the ground exhausted. The humans, though, took Astaroth advantage of the opportunity to put Astaroth in the effigy in the correct cage and cast us to the bottom of a lake of lava. The imbeciles! They sent Astaroth to the something. Why don't you go to kill Astaroth yourself? Unfortunately, I am so old that what if I were to leave the Temple Island, I would crumble to dust. Which is exactly what I shall do as soon as Bakiel has found a new master. I can't, I can't wait to finally sleep. Do you really think I'm the Nomad Soul? Yes. You truly are the Nomad Soul. You deserve Bakiel. I only hope that... Uh, I only hope that you will do better than I did and rid the universe forever of the Master of Darkness. What should I do now? Trust your instinct and never lose control of yourself. Go in, Destiny waits. There's my... De and he's dead. He's so fucking dead.
Oh, there's a magic ring. So I guess this is the body, this little horned blue dude is the body we're going to use to defeat the ultimate king of darkness. Magic portal seems to be deactivated. Oh wait, I gotta pick up the sword, right? Wait, did I get the sword? Yeah, I got the sword. Oh, for fucks, then what do I do? What do I do, chat? Oh, okay. I think this may be the final area. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I wonder is this unreasonably difficult? You know, the design's kind of okay. Like, it's kind of a cool hell demon design. Oh, I, I don't- look, I, I'm gonna be real chat, I don't fucking care about all this stuff. He's free! That looks like it should be destroyed, but it's not. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Does he have something on his back? Oh, there we go. Oh my god, I can't believe I have to do this with a Dreamcast controller. Oh yeah! That was pretty good. Come on. No fucking way! Please end, please end, please end. The revolution is over. The awakened ones have achieved their goal. They have destroyed the machine that governed from now on. The human race will be free to choose its destiny.
Just let people know all those subs. You can get a discount over at iPatchWolves.com. I don't know, know quite how it works, but if there's a problem, let me know. There's David Bowie! There's David Bowie! And there's the, the Eternal Queen who was in it also. This is the last time I will use my magic rings to teleport you. I have no idea who this is. I've literally, I don't know that I've ever seen this character for the entirety of the playthrough. Who are you, old man? I am the renegade sorcerer. Oh, your one's dad. Thanks for your assistance, Matana Bokias. So, one of my marks of, like, bad fiction is when people are just are like, and then the sorcerer, Fathra Madhu, showed up. And it's like, you, do, you don't need, like, fantasy is not a lot of syllables, okay? Yeah, great zealous, this is the ultimate, but you did nothing. You have brought back my father. Restored his honor. Words cannot express my gratitude. The Azkiels have regained their pride. They fought valiantly with the humans to free Omicron, and now they are regarded as brothers, not as animals. Thank you for all you have done for my good. You have accomplished your destiny, Nomad Soul. Few men can boast. I have no idea who this guy is. My heart is sad to see you Look at these two babes. Achieved our goals. We will turn Omicron into a paradise. And I would I would probably I would probably hang out with Jenna a little bit. She's pretty Perhaps cool. In another time, another place, we could have loved each other and lived happily together. Fate. There has not been a single like hint of romance Our between these two the entire game. And now she's like, oh, we could have boned and it would have been awesome. Excellent point from Charming Viking here. An extended stay in this universe could cause you to lose your mind. You don't say. Oh, no. You must go back to your own dimension and live out your own destiny. It will probably seem very ordinary to you. But always remember Omicron and the extraordinary things you accomplished here. Omicron gives you back your soul. Make good use of it. May Viagra will come protect your steps. Are they attempting to do a meta, the soul is the player? Uh, okay. Um, Neosh98, Yovian, yes, they are attempting to do that. They are not being subtle about it. Earlier in the game, they are like, you, the one playing this game, your soul has been trapped here. You know, David Bowie singing, we all go through it sometimes. I couldn't think of a better way to describe this game. <laughs> they didn't even fade it out! Oh, they didn't even fade it out. That is unbelievable. Wow, that was... Uh, give me one sec, Jack. Just let me delete this game from my hard drive of my PC, because I don't ever, ever want to experience that again. Okay. I think I'm free. Um, I like I chat. I don't even know what to say. Look, look at my hair. Look at how fucking messed up my hair is. Cause I'm all I'm all bothered. Chat, like I just that was appalling. That is an appalling piece of media. So poorly designed and considered. I, I'm gen. I'm genuinely shocked. Wait, I thought you were playing the Dreamcast. Oh, sorry. Um, so back in the day, uh, deleting the file was slang for snapping the disc of a Dreamcast game. John, how will you be re rewarding Wooly for this awful game? Oh, I know exactly what I'm doing. And I am so excited. I have just been... Chat, I have been rehearsing the words 
for what I'm going to counter Wooly with in the next episode. It is going to be one of the most delicious moments of my entire life. Um, I cannot wait. Wooly left himself exposed. And I see my angle. I see my kill shot. And I'm going to get him with it. But what if he's already done it? What if he's already done it? One dinner. Or. What if Wooly pitched me this idea many months ago? And since then, in every casual conversation we've had, I've been steering it to find out if he's played, watched, or read everything that I'm going to recommend him. What if I found Wooly's Steam list? What if I have access to Wooly's PS Plus list and I've screen grabbed it all already so he can never hide it? What if I've accessed every account Wooly has been on? Just, you know, as a friend. Oh yeah, Wooly, here's my, here's my Nintendo friend code. Let me see yours. Oh, you've played all these games. Interesting. I knew this would happen. I've been readying for this for a long time. Wooly's nightmare is only beginning. And if you guys want to follow that nightmare, Versus Wolves Episode 3 should be out one week from Friday. So, uh, you know, enjoy. Okay, guys, that's going to do it. Ipatchwolves.com. If you're a Twitch sub, you should be able to get 15% off. Uh, buy some t-shirts. Have have a good time there. Uh, it's just just a, just a lot of, lot, lot, lot of great old designs going on over there. And um, thanks to everyone who's already bought some. And uh, yeah, uh, follow me, regular Eye Patch Wolf, and of course, Super Eye Patch Wolf. Guys, I love you all. Versus Wolves episode three out one week from Friday. Stay well, my friends. Bye bye.